hello guys today I am going to show you how to make a Java class and run it using the terminal okay so first of all we need to make a Java class so let's open your notepad so I'm gonna search their notepad and first of all let, let us save it so what are we gonna save I'm gonna give it a name as table and make sure that the file has a file extension called dot Java okay so save it as Java dot Java okay now so we are going to actually make a program which would take input from the user and then print the table okay so let's do that okay so I am going to first type class table okay then type public static void main then string x okay and okay then I'm gonna say substrum out print ln uh enter a number okay so enter a number and then the number would be enter so put it as n and then I'm gonna say okay so I need an input so I need to call the scanner class scanner uh, system dot n okay and that next end and this is gonna work here yeah. then what I'm gonna s uh, is a loop okay so I wanna print the table so I need a loop I would just I is one and I wanted the table to be printed till uh, I want the table to be printed till 10 okay so I would just go till 10 and oops I follow the semicolon okay and then I'm gonna do I plus plus okay uh, we don't need a br curly brass as big as the four is just a single statement okay it's not more than one statement so we don't need a curly brass as unwanted okay uh, one thing I wanna make is, is that this scanner class uh, we need to uh, import it because it's another class so I will import it it's not man. so okay import Java dot util dot star okay which will just import the scanner classes and then what I'm gonna say is I want to print the table so just I want to say system the one thing is that to copy that one okay it would be much better so just copy this stuff okay and what I'm gonna do I wanted the table to be printed in a format so I want first uh that number then the concatenation operator then i want the x sign which is usually used for tables okay uh, okay then the, again the concatenation operator and then the value i okay and then again the concatenation operator and, and i'm going to use that equal to sign okay 
and then I'm going to use that plus sign and then in this I'm going to uh, n into i which will give me the product okay fine uh, closing the main and closing the class okay I uh, hope so it's correct let us compile it and check okay okay so I'm gonna save it uh, yeah I think forgot the curly braces here yeah so uh, first I'm gonna save it down okay it's already saved so but save it okay and make sure that you save it at to such a destination where you can reach easily otherwise if you don't know the de destination you cannot run that particular uh, project okay now open your terminal uh, since in my case in this directory I'm only having that uh, table file so first I'm going to compile that and write it Java C uh, table uh, dot uh, Java okay let's see oops there is an error oh where is that uh, oh we missed the new keyword yeah uh, let's correct it okay ah yeah any I'm just calling the instant yeah hope so this should work fine now uh, again run it oh yeah it compiled now now what I'm gonna do is that for running uh, you need to type Java and then the name of the file which you want to compile and uh, run sorry and that is table dot Java okay and now it is asking me enter the number I would put 9 and then you can see got the table okay uh, not only this particular class you can run any class you want suppose I've got a class name as number so first I want to just compile that class okay okay number number dot Java this will compile this class and then I'm when I'm going to type uh, number dot Java there this should work okay that's nothing it's a very simple program does nothing if you type one two three and then print uh, three then it will print all the possible combination of this number okay uh, you can try more of that such type if you uh, print for example apple or mango for example okay and then print all the five words it will give you all the possible combination of mangoes so in this similar way you can run many such classes okay with no problems uh, if you remember uh, the file location where you save the file okay okay guys so for this video uh, it's this much only please hit that red button subscribe red red subscribe button and share this video like please co do comment how is the video quality how's the audio quality and f f keep watching this channel thank you